Hello my dear health seekers, Inga from Health Origins here um, and we're chilling out on the sofa here again and I'm bringing you a second tip of my weight loss unlocked um, program habits. So six healthy habits I teach in my weight loss unlocked program and this is habit number two. So So let's recap. Habit number one was hydration and I'm doing just that um, this morning um, drinking my healthy cola. I ran out of molasses so I'm substituting with some date syrup here um, and um, now we're on to habit number two. So habit number two is removing oil from your kitchen entirely, right? So um, you might say, well, how am I supposed to fry things? And it's super easy. In fact, I've got a video on my channel, which I will link below and then the card above as well, how you fry without using oil. So you basically either fry on a nonstick pan or you could use a, um, a stainless steel um, pan. Um, if you use stainless steel pan, you need to heat it to the point where when you drop water droplet in, it rolls around and that's when it's um, reached the non-sticky stage. So um, so you can either use a stainless steel pan or a, even easier a non-stick um, pan, frying pan, and then you just add your onions, your celery, your carrot, whatever you need to fry or your mushrooms and let it fry a little until it starts sticking. So when it starts sticking, then you just add a couple of tablespoons, either water or I love adding olive brine, um, green olive brine, I like adding. So add a couple of tablespoons or you can do stock as well if you want to give it a little bit more flavor to things. But easiest is just water, a couple of tablespoons at a time. Uh, let it deglaze the pan to pick up all this caramelized sugar um, and then continue frying. And as you do this a few times, you'll see that your onions um, or uh, carrots or whatever you're frying getting a bit browner, caramelizing and just basically frying as they would with oil. Not quite, but you are um, saving yourself unnecessary calories and not a very healthy substance. So actually, let me bring you something to show. So this is a chart, if you can see this, yeah? So on this side we've got um, calorically, um, very little calorically dense, um, dense things, which is your vegetables, and on here, the top bar, the most calorically dense, is your oil, okay? So um, just think about it, and, not, and, and remove oil not just from frying, but also from salads. I know a lot of you think that um, olive oil um, and coconut oil and these kinds of oils are healthy, they're good for us. No oil is healthy and no oil is good for us, right? They're extractions, they're not whole food. Um, yes, you might say we need some healthy fats and we do, however, we get our healthy fats from olives, we get our healthy fats from avocados, nuts and seeds and that is plenty. We don't need any more additional extracted oil and in fact oil actually damages um, epithelial cells in your intestinal tract so it's inflammatory. Um, so especially if you um, have any kind of pains and aches in your joints and um, it's, it's making the inflammation worse if you use oil. And even olive oil is not a healthy oil. Um, you know, one tablespoon of oil added to salad is another 120 calories. 
um, and you don't just add one tablespoon of oil to the whole bowl of salad you probably add three or four so let's say if you added three tablespoons of oil to your salad dressing then you already added 360 calories of oil just to begin with um, and your salad might be just you know 200 calories on its own or you know even less so you basically more than doubling the calorific density of your meal just by adding you know a couple or three tablespoons of oil to your salad so yeah so remove oil completely from your cooking and from your salads and from just anywhere any recipes do not use oil and if you're stuck of how to make it without oil um, I've got tons and tons of all my recipes apart from like the old the very old ones uh, where I use some coconut oil for cheesecake and, uh, and things like that but all you know my majority of my um, recipes on this channel are oil free because that's what I'm all about is healthy oil free plant based dishes so so yeah so just have a browse around and you'll see how I replace oil in different scenarios um, so for in risotto for example I use coconut cream you know from the top of coconut can I use a little bit of that to glaze the rice and, and the the onions to give that like creamy taste the same in curries I add coconut milk for that creaminess but everything you know frying wise I just fry with water or stock or olive brine and it's so so simple so that's my second tip healthy habit develop that habit try it give it a go um, just basically stop using oil and see how easy it is it's not that difficult once you know the techniques of how to properly fry things without oil um, then you're not gonna miss it and you're gonna save yourself unhealthy substance and also unnecessary calories so this is my habit number two uh, from my weight loss unlocked uh, program uh, that I've got and um, I'm just doing this series to help you guys and together why we're in this lockdown and this pandemic together um, we could um, move on to um, your healthier weight to be on the way to your ideal weight so um, stacking up healthy habits one um, week at a time so every Wednesday um, this is habit number two we've got four more to go I'll be adding on a new habit for you to follow and um, the way I do this you know I implement it week by week so that you know you don't need to apply them all all at once and overwhelm yourself so by staggering them do, giving you a week to implement the first then the next you add on the second one and then you have an, a week to implement that one it just becomes more ingrained and becomes easier to stick to so I hope you're doing your hydration habit number one already and you've done it for a week if you haven't you could even restart so start at week one if you just arrived at my video um, do a week of hydration then add in um, no oil cooking or if you think you can manage to at, at one week you could do that uh, both eliminate oil from your cooking and also um, drink an extra half a liter of water um, through the day I prefer drinking it in the mornings so I hope you enjoyed my video give me a thumbs up if you're liking this series and um, let me know if you have any other questions about how to implement this habit and um, I'll be happy to help um, and answer those in comments for you and if you're new here subscribe for um, my other videos um, on Wednesdays and then I'll do meal prep for weight loss show every Saturday helping you to prepare healthy delicious meals for the week until next time and remember food is fuel so be mindful of what you put in the body see you